what is up everybody welcome back to trcby a show and we are just making our way through this uh new chapter 10 we are almost at the end so i wanted to do some recording because these are they look like new bosses here so i wanted to go ahead and give you guys a little bit of a preview if you have not reached chapter 10 just yet or if you're just uh making your way so uh, we're gonna start from top to bottom or bottom to top who's to say Ooh, i got a chicken over there <laughs> nice all right we're gonna start off with this guy let's do this so here is my setup i've used this setup for the entire run so far i don't know how uh, well my other weapons would have done but bleed set like is phenomenal like you know bear in mind my bleed set is a t8 enchantment level 5 it's pretty capped at the moment but they did if you notice something they were uh, able to upgrade you to a t8 plus 5 like uh, in uh <laughs> not enchantment level 5 but you could do a t8 5 so if you go to under collection this is our new cap with this new chapter so Plus five will be the, uh, and you could also enchant one more, giving an even more physical attack. That is ridiculous. 1946. <gasps> oh my gosh. I'm gonna do it. But you need six of those. So if you were to enchant, that is a humongous boost. Like, no joke. From 16 to 18, that is a huge leap. Even though it's just 200. It's huge. That is a big leap. And you could craft it at um, Pandora. But if you got it, do it. If you don't have it yet, it's okay. So I am going to uh, I'm gonna do two things. I'm going to use my T8 Legendary. And then we're also going to switch it up to a non-legendary, which is a T7. So T7 isn't too challenging to get i mean it'll take a time effort and whatnot oh these guys are all new but check out the bleed set awesome this is my first time doing it of course so uh we are just rolling through these guys together let's uh let's go ahead and just slam slam body slam all over the place boom boom a boom and so we are just like this is just really cake right now although we are pretty um, not pretty low, but like we're lower than the recommended, but, but not by that much. But just showing you how awesome the bleed set is. So this is a double crescent and I'm using Raven and I'm also using, um, why do I forget people's name? My companions, I've been with you for so long and, um, oh my goodness. Ooh, hey, another one. All right, so Raven and Rowan. <laughs> so Raven and Rowan. All right, so we're just going to switch it up to a non-legendary. And it's a T7. So if you are around the T7 area, so uh, this is just an even 1,000, close enough to 1,000 physical attack. If you have a physical attack that's 1,000, let's just take a look and see how we do. I think we should more or less stay the same so i don't know any of these guys weaknesses Ooh, it's a raid so raids are fairly easy i like the raids they just come to you and you just kind of uh, slap them around and grab whoever and everybody wins with the slams like oh hey thank you so much nice and easy and i'm hardly like dodging at all like really not dodging really at all so i'm just kind of going through this shooting people up boom boom a boom and not using my companion skills really bam and there you go big boss is here let's uh let's go ahead and use rowan and raven the double r's boom 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 finishing that finishing that pulling whoever in and slamming doing this super easy with this particular set because i don't know i i just don't know how else i would clear all these mobs so easily because 
one of the great benefits of the Double Crescent. It's got this massive AoE naturally. It's just a lot bigger in terms of the range that it captures. So non-legendary, you could still do it. You don't have to do a T8 and there we go. So we could go ahead and do that boss, but I want to check out some of these other guys. I've never seen this one before. Let's check him out and see what he's all about. We're going to pop on our legendary for this one. You know what? Let's, let's try the Skylark. Why not? So this is all bleed set. Again, like I'm just testing out different weapons. So we use the legendary double crescent, non-legendary double crescent. We use the legendary Skylark. Ooh, it's another raid. Let's just see how this one does. Finishing move. Boom, 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 boom. Ooh. Uh, Animation-wise, this may be really cool. Boom. Aerial. Get a little bit. Oh, a hidden monster. Awesome. Let's uh, finishing move for collateral damage. And a little kicky up in the air. A little aerial for everybody. Boom. Yeah, I, I like the bleed set. Bam, 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 bam. And a little bit of an aerial move again. Boom. And kicking someone up. Bam. Finishing move for the collateral damage all over the place. All right. Oh, my goodness. You know what? I have, like, zero regrets getting the Shadow Templar up to uh, where it is now. No regrets at all. It's just such an awesome armor. It just looks really cool and it plays really well into the outfit and the play style, the Skylark or like any of the Devil Crest. I don't know. I just think it looks cool. So not my strongest weapon, of course. Not like the Devil Crescent over there, but it's still doing pretty good damage. And here you go. Just, uh, you know what? We didn't even get to check out this guy. Let's, let's take a pause back a little bit here. Let's see what this guy's about before we start killing him. All right, he looks pretty cool. Look at this dude. He's like, I'm hurting inside. My life hurts. Let's take this off. What does he do? He does a charge, a little slappity round, and then he falls down. I feel bad for this guy. Oh, so sad. Zoom, 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 zoom. <laughs> oh, and a kick in the butt. Bam. You know what? He is going to die. I just want to see what else he is doing. But I think I kind of got him on the lock. Bam. Boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> oh, man. That's awesome. So, bleed set seems to work well. So, armor is extremely important. So, you want to make sure you're able to take hits. I guess regardless of whatever armor you're using. And we got ourselves a nice little chicken. Thank you so much. And let's go ahead and take a look. Let's try something else as well, too. I think that was the hell version of this guy. Let's change it up to... I don't know. Let's do a stun lightning build, I guess. Or we could just use a stun... Yeah, let's do a stun lightning build. Let's do that. Let's see what happens here. I have not tried this yet. It may be terrible. It may be like, ooh, what are you doing there? Get back to the, the bleed set. But we're just testing it out. So if you don't have like a bleed set, could you still do these uh, maps as easily as um, something else without it? And I think the grab is still pretty good. Like all these guys seems to uh, be status effect fairly easily which makes it super easy to uh, complete so here we go going on to the next place that's not too bad as well too and let's shoot him up who are you boom I just drop you and I am going to jump on somebody do a triple slam on you bam not too bad either I guess it's all good so the trash boss or the trash mobs aren't that terrible. Let's focus on you and see what happens here. Oh, yep. Not too bad at all, actually. Boom and a boom. So definitely like anything really would work. Look at that. Nice and easy. So bleed set, stun set. Everything seems to be pretty good. Zoop. 
a zoop. Oh, so there you go. Let's try an aerial set next. You know what? Since these mobs are fairly easy, at least I'm thinking they are, to uh, what I currently have, let's do the last, not the last, but maybe one of this in a test phase. We'll do one aerial, and then we are going to do the ice dragon, the freezing dragon fang, which is our new weapon. It's a T7, it's enchantment level 1, it's not strong at all by any means, so... We're still going to test it out. So even if you have a T7 level 1 enchantment, are you able to just clear the trash easily? I guess we'll find out. Let's shoot you guys up. And come on. Come on now. Boom. Uh, ba boom. I don't need to uh, do any more for you. Let's go to the next. Come on. Where are you taking this guy? All the way down here. All by yourself. It will be great if you could knock them off into the lava pit that will be like funny but then if you could knock them off <laughs> hopefully they they can't knock you off okay let's get these guys let's see if we get an aerial yeah nice we'll cluster up everybody wins here you go winner a winner with lady gray clustering everybody up is still nice nice little tactic as well let's go ahead and finish you off and we don't need to do the rest of that let's go to the last guy right here and here you are I want a skeleton bro I'm not you sure why you got targeted but here we go let's get you up can we get some collateral damage going on here there you go so trash guys not too bad at all and boom and oh yeah that's right I should have waited but it's okay because they're uh her thing came back up, and I'm able to do this. A little slicing. So, Aerial build. Ugh, can I get you back up there again? There you go. Do another Aerial juggle. And... So, Aerial build, not the strongest. You know, it's not hitting it for as much as I would like. But it is still doable. Alright, so now we're going to hit up the, uh, the dragon, the freezing dragon fang. And see how that does. <laughs> Christmas gigantic. Oh my gosh, you look ridiculous. Alright, let's go on to this one. Prepare for battle. We're going to switch it off. Let's see, do I have the freezing dragon fang? Here it is. So this is the aerial dragon, freezing dragon fang. Let's see how we do with this particular setup. So this is only a singular T7. It's not... Anything particular, the attack power is 650, and that is well below all of my other T8s here that we're using. So we know that all of these could work, but this is significantly less. Power level of, yeah, knocks me down quite a bit. But if you are in this particular situation where you are a T7, you're not quite there yet, and this is like power level 11,000 recommended it's like 13,000 could you still do it and uh, we're here to find out let's uh, see what happens here just twirling everybody around is pretty nice and slamming them up and capturing everybody again and impaling and twirling and it seems to work just fine as well too wow you know what if I had this one up to a t8 and full enchantment level I believe it would be awesome as well too look at this you're just whipping the dudes around because they're all clustered and then let's cluster them up a little bit more again let's impale and just twirl and then they are done so not too bad chop 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 <laughs> oh man so this reminds me of i think this like chapter four like the chapter four terrain very similar i think you know what let's use this oh boom Impaling, twirling you around, and slamming, and more jabby jab jab jab, and slam, more impale. I think I could get another aerial now, another impale. Let's keep you up. It's like a stun or an aerial juggle. There you go. Grab you, twirl you around, breaking you up. 
not the easiest and a little aerial juggle over there do this again little twirl breaking your armor and then jab to the face and then do another slam another impale and then lady grace is up and then i'll just use you to juggle you up again do a little jab and then do another impale i think i missed on the jab but it's okay and then breaking your armor gigantic do your thing send him in the aerial grab again twirl you around and you're done so definitely doable with less uh than t7 i would even say it'll give you the opportunity to like look at the levels and uh check it out and see what like the enemies do anything above i would say the t7 it's nice easy breezy you should be able to do it no worries but if you are even less than that ooh, let's try this out so even if you are let's just say you're not there just yet with a t7 all right let's say and you don't have a double crescent i think everybody at this particular point you should have like uh something let's just say like uh if you yeah a skylark a, like a lightning skylark if you are up here you should have gotten the lightning skylark from defeating the scorpion king as a reward so this is a known thing i guess like a dome reward and you should be able to have that but let's just go down even more and if you don't even if yeah, <laughs> I don't know. I'm trying to see what uh, the weakest weapon that is most common that someone else may have. Let's go with, oh my gosh, these are th T3s. That may not be enough to do it. I'm, I'm still sticking with around like the 600. You could definitely do it. The 400s, you, like T5s. I would say like you know you won't be here in this particular area if you're a t5 you won't be doing chapter 10 so much because you'll be working on your gear and we were at chapter 9 for quite a while and i think most of uh you guys are or who have been playing are all caught up but the new guys that just started playing hopefully there's new people it's a great game welcome if you're new so um you should i don't know be working on some of these other weapons up here so i don't know what to really use let's just say you don't have a legendary and you don't log in every day and you just don't have something it's like a nightfall or again the skylark let's use the skylark all right we're going to use the skylark because that is a given reward we know that you'll have it with the scorpion king so let's just say we have the skylark to defeat the scorpion king which is chapter eight and then we did chapter 8 and then chapter 9 and now this is chapter 10 and so you should have this at the very least and can we do this with the lightning set instead of a bleed set i'm saying yeah i'm thinking we can it's just uh it looks really cool look at all the collateral damage that we're doing on all these guys and boom just like grab and go kick somebody finishing them up and just jumping from the flashiness of it all i like it i like the skylark it's just super flashy and i wish i had uh, a little bit more because i think you could get two more animation of a slice when you level it up a little bit more and i haven't even used there you go come on arcane help me out a little bit here it's just so flashy <laughs> it's like flashy flash boom let's shoot you up let's use solar to break you a little bit and gonna kick boom where did i go there not sure Ooh, i'm like all over the place let's keep you up in the air let's use arcane let's use a kick and let's use a finishing move boom 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 not as quick definitely doable though absolutely doable and it's looking really good for us here and you are almost done boom and now you're stunned as well too. Kick you. Finishing move and you should be done. Bam, bam, bam. A bam. A bam. So I definitely do like the look of the uh, the Skylark. It's just super flashy. And looks really cool. Alright, so we did that. And that is awesome as heck. Alright.
Now, I believe we cleared everything. Yeah. So every single boss here cleared, even though you could just take a particular route to here, uh, we decided to clear the entire map. All right, here it is. I'm just gonna open this up, uh, full screen, take a screenshot for myself, and let's, uh, let's go at it. Let's see what we could do. So prepare for battle. Let's take a look at the discussion board. We're going to attack guy. So the flame, ooh, it's a cockatrice. It's a monster with high burn resistance and super armor defense. So high burn resistance, don't use it. Use ice, I suppose, right? When it has a sw sw what? Uh, swallow flames or swollen flames. I, I don't know why I can't read. All, all of its attack burn its target what however while it attempts to swallow the flame it spews up it will be weak against certain status effect wait for the moment it spews flame to strike recommended status effect is air and slow oh oh discussion board is air set duelist hey and that's the only thing we got so far do we have an air set duelist well, we got an air set Skylark, maybe? Maybe. Maybe we should use the Ice Dragon Fang, because that's an aerial. Let's give that a try. I, I'm saying we should give it a try, and I think we are. We're going to try it like this. So we're going to try not the strongest. Again, this is going in undergeared. Let's see how we do. So if you're at 11,000 or under power. <laughs> sniff, sniff. What's that? It smells like chicken. <laughs> what are you talking about all of a sudden? Oh, you must have a hankering for some wings. No, you little punk. It really smells like chicken. I don't know if it smells like chicken or not. But there's something hiding up ahead. We should approach with caution, savior. Dun, dun, dun. And here it is. <laughs> okay, wow. God is above. It really is a chicken. What did I tell you? I know chicken when I smell it. <laughs> oh, calm down, you two. It may look familiar, but that's no chicken. It's a beast known as a flame cockatrice. Okay, and it's still alive. Yeah. Oh, don't worry about that. It'll be on a skewer in no time. <laughs> you tub tub. Mr. Tubby tub tub. What moves are you doing, good sir? Okay. Boop. Uh, can I kick and break you? Oh, what if I did this? Oh, my way. Ooh. And boom. Ooh. Wow. Lava on the ground. Okay. No one likes that. You know what else could work? I'm thinking if we use Tanya. I don't know. Again, these are all just guesses. First time trying. And maybe first time failing. Who's to really say? So... Swallowing the flames. What do you mean by that? I'm not seeing you swallowing any flames. Is this the swallow move? Is that what it is right there when you are at your weakest? I'm thinking maybe that's the case. Red skull. Can I kick you and do something here? You just be whipping around. Wow. Nope. Hey, 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 hey. Kick in the butt. What are you doing here? Boy, hey, hey, stop pecking my eyes out. I'm like hardly doing any damage. I think it's because I have to, uh, okay, was that the swallow in the move? Boom. Get out the way. Kick. Ooh, kicking me, huh? Ooh. All right, I am not doing any damage to this guy. Like, like hardly any. Like, <laughs> it's still got like 99% HP. And what are we doing? So, it is weak against something. Maybe not this something at the moment. So, is this when it's swallowing stuff? And, nope. I think I may not be able to survive. Okay, so it also regens HP, it seems like, when it does that. And I'm not doing enough damage to it. All right, so this particular setup may not be the best. F 
for me at this time. So you know what? I can't do that. It's just that I'm not taking away enough HP for it when it does its uh, move. Oh, all right. Let's let's take a time out for Twix here. Let's see what it's doing. It's chase me. It's what it's doing. That's one. Okay, and the move is a peck peck, a peck peck. And then now I believe that's the swallow move. And is this one it's weak against an aerial? And then maybe. Now it's just doing the flame whip and twirl. And pecking that lady a gray. What is up with that? Don't you peck that lady gray. Get out of here. Alright, so it spits out. And here is... The swallow, I believe that's what it is right there. I'm looking at. That's the swallow move. I missed on that. Alright. So it was an Aereo Skylark build, was one of the recommendation. No, the duelist build with an Aereo. Can we do that? Alright, let's uh let's go and abandon this battle we're gonna switch up our gears a little bit I don't really use the duelist but uh, we could give it a try for sure let's go and switch that up to a duelist that I don't really use is there another duelist weapon that may be better uh, but that's a lightning set and this is a down one do I need to use an aerial? Is it truly an aerial? I don't know. Let's let's try this first. We are going to try. No, let's. If we're going to try that, let's just do this. All right. So this is going to be a um bo 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 boom. Let's switch some stuff up real quick. I'm going to put on our set here. The set for that is, where is that? There you go. All right, so that's the aerial set. I'm going to change up our pet to one of you guys for aerial. All right, let's, uh, let's give this a go. But it's not lightning that it's re like um, weak to. It's slow, which is cold. So I'm thinking it could be... A different combination but we're just testing this is the first time so we're kind of enjoying new content we're not really out here just to you know plow through it it would be nice but we're just learning just checking it out and seeing what this is all about okay we're getting burned you know what maybe I should add like a lead miller next just to keep me alive a little bit longer okay oh no don't you do that stop doing that to me Okay, are you sucking in stuff now? Is that what it is? I don't really know. I think you are. Are you? No. I just got slapped. Kick. No. No. Alright, what are we doing here? What are we doing? Slice. And that's the, that's the drawing right there. Okay, that's the swallowing the flames. Okay. I am going to save... My companion skill. So this doesn't seem to be working too well at all. Not one bit. But there are. We are learning a few stuff. You know, getting used to the moves. Oh no, that was a fake out. I got fake. I got faked. I got psyched. I got psyched out on that. I thought that was the uh, the swallow move. All right, so that was not. So after it uh, kicks me around a little bit. I'm not sure when it does its uh, swallow, but let's see. Boom. There it is. Let's do that. So when the ground starts going towards it, that's the swallow move. And that is when it's weak. But that is now stun. Ooh, you know what? I'm going to try a stun move here. I'm going to try try stunning and slam the chicken. Now that I see that this... Ooh, I got a finishing move. No. Finish. Boom. Bam, 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 bam. Okay. So, we were able to do that. But it still has got a lot of HP. Like, a lot more HP than... Let's, uh, let's go ahead and do this as well, too. So, that is a boatload of HP. And I'm thinking... 
I may have to use lead millet just to keep me alive a little bit longer because I don't think I'm able to just plow through this guy because it regens HP as well too. All right, so this is not going to be a win situation for us. We're going to abandon the battle. Let's think about this a little bit here. Let's think about this. All right, preparing for battle. And instead of trying recommendation, let's go with this real quick. Let's let's just test out the bleed set. So the bleed set has been working for us before. Let's see how it will do now. Could we pull it out and slam it? And can we just bleed the chicken out? Let's bleed out the chicken. Can we do that? We just stack up all of the bleeding. And just uh, like the armored gorilla, for example. Like that dude was tough. And I remember I couldn't even get close to him in terms of like doing anything. But is bleeding possible for this flaming chicken here? Can we do the flaming chicken bleed? Oof. It's not easy, for sure. I want to uh, get a bleed going on here so I could do a pull. So if I do a pull, yep, I could do that. Knock it out of its uh, little thing here. And if I do this, once I get that first bleed set or the first thing, that's not too bad. Do this. Yep, I could definitely slam it. Shoot it up. Use a little bit of a raven. And pull back and pull him out of its thing. Do a slam move. Boom. So I'm thinking double. Again, bleed set seems to be pretty nice. So if I just get a little bit more head, I could definitely... Oh, hey now. Messed up my pull. Alright. But it's okay. Because bleed set has a natural regen, if you notice. Like if I pull you in... I get a little bit of regen as well too on the bleed set. And then I'm also disrupting, from what it seems like, I'm disrupting his uh, regen as well too. So there you go. Boom, I'm gonna grab, slam you, stop you from doing whatever it is that you were doing, sucking in all those flames, and do the same thing. Pull you in, shoot you up, shoot up the chicken here. I'm just feathering you chicken. Oh no. Pull you in here. Get over here. A little slice, slice, slice. So, here you go. So, bleed set, I think we could do. Bleed set definitely seems to be a good combination. What is this? It's like lava spewing all over the place here. I don't want to stay on in lava. So, I'm going to shoot you up. Just dodge out to the way to get that little bit of uh, room here. And move out. Oh, I just got hit. Got interrupted, Mr. Man. You are interrupting me. Okay, pull you in. I think we could do the bleed set. I think definitely the, <clears throat> like, uh, a way to do it here is just with the bleed set. Hey, 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 hey. You cut that out, chicken. And dropping some more flames on me. Pull you in. Get over here. That was, a like, across the... The map pull right there. That's pretty nice. Alright, so pull you in. Oh boy. Here we go. You're like the golden chicken. Hey, 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 hey. A little laggy though. I do not want to get hit by that. And shoot you up. Let's, uh, let's continue with the bleed. I don't want Raven to die. Raven, don't you die. I want to get another set going on here. Throw that out. Let's go. Don't die, guys. Don't you die. Don't you die on me. But he does hit really... Like, uh, there's a lot of attacks going on here. A lot of quick attacks from the chicken. Raven, could you, like, not stand in fire, please? Like, I'm just asking you to not stand in fire. Like, why are you standing in fire? Like, get out of here with the fire. Oh, I was not able to to disrupt him and Raven is down. Raven, you have uh, disappointed me. You are a disappointment. Standing in fire all the time. Okay. And I think I need to uh, not die myself. 
We were doing so well. Okay, hold on a second here. Hold on a second here. No. We were doing so close. We were so close. We were so close to the bleed set. Oh my goodness. Get over here, chicken. And, ooh. All of my companions are dead. So it's just me and the chicken. So one day, it's like a story. I was hanging out with my chicken friend and we're just having a good time trying to get a barbecue going on here oh boy can i do it by myself what is this dark matter over here what is that about so it's like lava and something else okay i am just getting slammed here but we are learning its move slowly but surely Ooh, I need to pull you out get over here do a little slicing and I don't want this. No. Hey. Hey, 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 hey. Little, little lag. Little peck in the face when it does the wind up. Boom. Ooh. But the spray of the flames and that gooey stuff. I'm not sure what that's about. But uh, not, not really good. I'm getting burnt here. I am getting rotisserie savior and it stays on the ground for such a long time too. It's kind of hard for me to build up the bleed. Ooh, the flame is just everywhere. You don't want to stay on the on here on this ground stuff here. All right. No. I'm not going to make it. Can I pull you out of here? Get a little bit of health. Move out the way. Oh my goodness, this chicken. This chicken here. Oh, you. Oi, that lag. Oi. Oi. Oh, there's like no safe spots here. Okay. I'm going to shoot you up. I need to uh, get something going on here. It's all this gook stuff that's on the ground. And get away. Get away. Get away from me, you crazy flaming chicken. Oh my goodness, I'm going to die. No. I don't want to die. Why? There's just, it stays there for a like ever. Ooh. Okay. Move. Got to keep on moving. Just keep on moving. Can I get you here? Nope, I'm dead. All right. Oh boy, I think we could get the, uh, all right, all right, I got an idea. I have an idea. I'm still going to use my bleed set, but I is got an idea. So my idea is here. So we're going to change up this combination. Who are we going to use? I believe we are going to be using switch you off. But we are still going to use a bleed set. The bleed set is going to be with Ludmilla. Here. All right, here we go. I need that. I need some heals, man. I just need a little bit of the heals because I think we could do this. I genuinely believe we could do this, and I think this is the way to go because we need we need the heals to uh, help us out when we're low, and also the heals will uh, break as well too so it's not going to cure like our uh, other one over here can we do this can we do this we'll break we'll pull you in i think we could do this here with some heals going on here oh my goodness i need to get that distance to do the pull there you go get over here do a little bit of a raven. I think I got the slam, maybe. Nope, not just yet. Oh, just wasted that gun move. All right. Go back in here. Can I be a little bit more... What's the word I'm looking for? Not savvy. Can I just be a little bit more like uh, brute force? All up in his face with Ludmilla. Can I do that? Let's give that a try. I'm going to try to heal myself a little bit as well, too. Boom, 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 boom. Get that distance going on over here. I'm going to shoot you up. 
There we go. Get in here. Oh, need to pull you in now. Get over here. I didn't really need to use Ludmilla, but um, maybe. Doesn't hurt. Okay, pull you in. And I'm gonna shoot you. Can I do this? Wasn't interrupted. Awesome. I think I just need that distance to pull. Pull you in here. And slice you up. Yeah. I think this is uh this is the way. Going full into with uh Raven and Rowan, not the best because you do need a little bit of heals. And look at us. We are doing pretty good. So our guys aren't dead, so that's that's a good sign. Raven isn't uh, dying because he's always standing in fire for some reason. Thank you, AI. Thank you, Mr. Raven. And also, Ludmilla, of course, healing everybody. Everybody gets a nice heal from her. Let's shoot you up. And do this. A little bit laggy, man. I'm not sure what's going on here. Let's pull you in. Use a Raven. And you know what? I'll heal myself as well, too. Look at that heal. It's like so good. But it also is healing itself as well, too. We want to make sure that we are knocking it out. So it's not healing itself. Okay. What are you doing here, buddy? What are you doing here? I need you to uh, not knock everybody around. Can I get some more? I'm not sure why it's so laggy though. Let's uh, let's do this. My inputs are, aren't. All right, I think I lagged out. None of my inputs are working. Yep. Oh, okay. Come on. Now it's just auto battle. All right, I think I froze. Okay. It's not working. I'm gonna have to restart. Hold on a second. Be right back. All right, so uh, the stun build seems to work, but the stun build, you have to wait until he does his massive swallowing move, where then he turns himself into a red skull. I thought I was recording, but apparently not. But uh, that is the first one, so we were able to uh, do that, and woo, that was, uh, that was a fight. So we did it with a stun build, a four stun build. All right. Let's see. Oh, damn. I don't think I could hold out any longer. Maybe now's the time to spill the beans, Thea. Tell us why we shouldn't kill that little brat. Mm, that little brat is one thing, but don't forget that we still haven't heard the story behind Toledo's last expedition. Mm. Uh, I think we deserve at least uh, hear one story or the other, Thea. Mm. <laughs> like, fine, but please keep moving while we talk. I'll tell you as we pursue Meteora. Okay, so where do you want to start? Why we shouldn't kill Meteora or the story behind Toledo's final expedition? They're, they're not distinct. The two stories intertwine. To begin this tale, we must revisit the distant past. We must return to that very day when the Savior was born. Dun dun dun! A cleared! Boss cleared. Man, I gotta go check my recording because I thought I was recording, but apparently I'm not. But uh, again, we were able to do it with the stun build. It's a force stun build. We'll go back and uh, we'll show you guys what uh, we did. And ooh, Toledo. Ah, I'm done. This is my last dimensional riff. I can't do this anymore. I won't do this anymore. Imagine the King Pantera lying in the streets like a bum. You're a disgrace to your country. The most important thing is that we have successfully closed all the dimensional rifts in this canyon. If we could have done it sooner, we would have saved the people of Vestaria. I can't find any solace in this. That's why we need to hunt more monsters. We must get your revenge by killing, killing every last one. Ah, oh, enough. Everyone sure has a lot to say. Pipe down and get some rest. Uh, those Saint Crones will be here bossing us around before you know it. It seems you have no intention of rethinking the use of the term Crones. Uh, hey, they say bad habits are the hardest to break. Whoa, 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 whoa. Cabell. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was a timeout for Twix here. Who is this? 
Who is this? And then Pandora. I don't care what you call me. This whole endeavor is annoying. This faithful servant of the goddess is honored to meet the three saints. By the goddess, I am in your service. It is an honor to meet you, three holy sisters. Uh, hey, Solar, you stuttered. Uh, shut up. You're such an idiot. <laughs> like, seems we arrived just in time. Yes, we tore apart all the monsters and closed every dimensional rift in this area. We are ready to see away the evil energy rising from the cracks in the earth. Let's not waste any time. Toledo, you take the lead. <sighs> Toledo, snoring. Cynthia, allow me to deal with him. Like this and this. I'm, hey, hey, Teal, you little punk. Watch the stomach. The stomach. I'm Chihuahua. Okay. So here is the next one. It goes right back to him again, I guess. So, ooh, okay. That was, uh, that was a very fun fight. So uh, I'm going to leave it at that. That is just chapter 10, the first stage of it. And we got a ways to go. So that's one out of 10. So uh, we clear that. So uh, I hope everybody's doing well, staying safe and healthy. Go out there and enjoy. Mess around. You don't have to um, be bound by a particular tactic. You could use whatever it is that works for you. Like the last one we saw, slow, area. we used a stun build. So... Whatever works. Whatever works for you, you got this. All right, so uh, I hope everybody's staying well or, like, you know, staying safe and healthy. And uh, peace.